We are pleased to present our summer landmark. Each season, our team of curators and category experts pull together a collection of the most extraordinary pieces sourced from our network of collectors, dealers, and beautiful estates. Here's a sneak peek at the caliber of inventory you can expect to discover. We have an exquisite painting by the renowned Hudson River School artist, Sanford Gifford, whose work previously set an EBTA's record. The work is in the Gifford Memorial Catalog and is recorded to have been in the family estate, which is confirmed by an estate stamp to the Verso. Gifford is particularly applauded for his mastery of light, which is beautifully demonstrated in this work with the stark illuminations and highlights throughout the tree and forest ground. We also have a stunning painting by the famed Cincinnati artist Frank Dubinek, featuring a portrait of a boy with a hurdy-gurdy. This Dubinek is unlike others that we've sold. It's among his larger portraits and it shows his earlier style with a darker palette and more refined brushstrokes. The painting was purchased directly from the artist in 1915 at the Panama Pacific Exposition. It was at that exposition that they actually featured an entire room dedicated to Dubinek's work. We're also very excited about a painting by the renowned abstract expressionist Franz Klein. It was painted circa 1947 and it exhibits the artist's style of the late 1940s showing more expressionist qualities as he was steering away from representation. It was his paintings in the late 1940s that served as inspirations and precursors to his trademark monumental black and white paintings. The suite of 18 karat gold jewelry boasting over nine carats of diamonds by the renowned Hammerman Brothers. The three Hammerman Brothers returned home to the United States after World War II to establish their esteemed jewelry studio in 1946. Natural pearls have been coveted for centuries by royalty and world leaders. Julius Caesar even passed laws that only aristocrats could wear natural pearls because of their rarity. A natural or native pearl is produced without human intervention, making these extremely rare. We love that we have the opportunity to present to you a strand of natural pearls with a vintage ruby clasp. Consider a watch born to race, the iconic Rolex Daytona Cosmograph, introduced in 1963, designed for the professional race car driver. The watch was further popularized by Paul Newman, who was gifted the Rolex Daytona by his wife, Joanne Woodward, and wore it throughout his pursuit of racing. The fashion and accessory selection in this sale features a nice collection of couture handbags. We are highlighting two Hermes Birkin bags and a Chanel Boy flap handbag. The iconic Hermes Birkin bag was introduced in 1984, designed after a chance meeting between Jean-Louis Dumas, the creative director at Hermes at the time, and the British actress Jane Birkin. The two were seatmates on an international flight when Miss Birkin complained that she was unable to find a structured leather handbag to her taste. The pursuing conversation led to the design of the Birkin bag which was actually drawn on the back of an air sickness bag. The classic Birkin bag is timeless and hasn't changed since. The Birkin Gillies special edition two-tone bag in clay has perforated detailing inspired by the Irish brogue boot, and our dark green Loden Birkin bag has contrasting piping and chartreuse at the edge. We have a pair of French brass candlesticks, 19th century, from the era of Charles X, decorated in palmettes and scrollwork. From the high age of British walnut, a circa 1720 Queen Anne walnut and cross banded double bonnet bureau bookcase. Ramon de Tirtoff, also known as Erte, also known as the father of Art Deco, created a patinated bronze sculpture we have called Splendor, which sums up the essence of his Art Deco craft. The sale runs June 19th through the 28th at ebth.com. If you're in the Cincinnati area, please join us for an in-person preview event Saturday, June 27th from 11 a.m. until 2 p.m.